Hi everyone and welcome back to Prefusion. So today we are back with a job notification update. So this time Hindustan Aeronautics Limited has come up with a job notification for all BEB tech who are from either electronics branches or from mechanical branches. So if you are from these two branches then you can uh, go along with this video or you can skip this video. But before you are going don't forget to hit the like button so that it can reach all of the people who are interested in this job. So HAL is a Navaratna Central Public Sector company right Navratna PSU so it's, it has many divisions you can read about that but here it is particularly uh, recruiting for the Hyderabad division so uh, the posts are given how many posts are there so there are assistant engineer post for you are there are three total three posts are there and if you are from these particular degrees then you are eligible for this electronics role and assistant engineer for mechanical role if you are from these uh, like the uh, Posts are given and if you have these degrees then you are eligible else anything written with mechanical right then you are eligible basically you have to have bachelors in mechanical or electronics domain so you can read about the reservations and these are the name of the posts and obviously the qualification is you have to have regular or full-time course from institutes slash universities which are recognized by appropriate statutory uh, bodies right so you have to have degrees full-time degrees and you have to have minimum of 60 percent marks in aggregate of all semesters basically in your final degree your marks should be either more than 60 percent or equivalent cgp ratings should be more than that okay so yeah these are the few uh, requirements now what should be your age limit the upper age limit is 35 years as on 8th of may okay for unreserved categories and for other reservations they have uh, further relaxations so yeah this you can follow along and these were a few, few important points and another important point is if you are selected and if you wish to join the company then you have to sign a bond service bond which is of two years so you have to uh, serve minimum of two years to the company so that uh, uh, you don't have to pay this bond if else if you want to leave the company before two years at maximum you may have to pay an amount of two lakh rupees and what are the p's how many how much salary range will you get so basically you your range will be 30k to 1.2 lakhs and uh, like uh, after calculating everything right it will be around 60k to 70k okay the uh, the amount salary that you will get okay and how to apply you basically go into this website and follow all of these instructions and you will be able to simply apply the application fee is of rupees 500 for unreserved uh, category and for reserved category it is exempted what is the selection procedure so selection pr procedure will be written test only there won't be any gate okay this is without gate so uh, the thing to note here is the level of the examination will be lower than the gate exam okay so level of the examination will be lower than the gate exam so what you can do you can prepare with the help of uh, those ssc uh, je e exams previous year papers those you can prepare okay for your uh, examination so this will be written test only the entire selection process will be based on the written test and uh yeah that, that they have told and it will be held on hyderabad so you have to go to hyderabad you have to bear all the prices what uh all, all the expenses that will occur okay and all those information about the written test the syllabus all those things will be intimidated to shortlisted candidates so they will shortlist first according to your qualifying degree then only they will be able to give the written test so the written test will be of two and a half hours it will consist of three parts the first part is all of them will be mcq first part is 20 questions on general awareness ga part 2 is 40 questions on on english and reasoning okay uh, this is the common part everyone will not be able to perform that well in this two parts but what you can do you can guess work because here there is no negative marking and the third part is the technical part where 100 questions will be there okay from your concerned discipline so each question will carry one mark and there won't be any negative marking so what you should do you should not leave any question you should attempt all the questions whatever happens happens because there is no negative marking and as i told candidates will have to appear at the written test at their own cost okay uh, all of this will be sent okay so when they are appearing for the written test they have to bring their admit card one original photo identity card and whatever they have told us uh, told here they have to bring that next is the selected candidates will be uh, selection of the candidates will be done based on the marks scored in the written test in order of merit okay only on the written test nothing else and the, after that you will have document verification all those things you will have okay so then you will also have a medical examination before you get the final employment so these are the few general uh, like instructions you can read all these things right you can read all these things i haven't gone through i've just highlighted the important points 
so and then they have given you all the formats of the application by how you can submit so you have to speed post or do something like that so you can read the instructions and then you can submit so yeah i hope you like the video i will see you in the next video